Good morning. Again, my name is Ebo Daniel, and so ahead of the census, uh, we are taking details of your household. Um, do we have permission? And by the way, all of the details you give us will be treated as confidential, and so it won't be shared with anybody except for the Ghana Statistical Service. I think it's the right thing to do, permission granted. This is a very neat thing to do. Uh, as a nation, we have to know our population structure. We have to know the number of people living in this country. Now, it's essential to know that because if we do, it will afford us the opportunity of knowing exactly how we can spread out our resources. It will afford us an opportunity to know the structure of our population. Now, whether the population is a pyramid or an inverted pyramid. Now, elsewhere, the pyramid is inverted. And each of them, whether it's inverted or non-inverted, has implications for the socioeconomic run of the, of the nation. So if you have a normal pyramid, then what it means is that you have a base at the middle age group supporting a few at the apex, that is the aged. If it's inverted, then you're going to be in trouble. You're going to be in trouble. Because you have a few people supporting large number of aged individuals. And this has implications for the way we run our nation. For insurance, for health, and all that. So it's good that I think once in a while we get to know the structure of our population. And I will encourage all Ghanaians to lend themselves to the process and be counted. So when you visit houses, I expect them to cooperate with you. Yes, to cooperate with you. And be patient and answer all the questions as well. So that together as a nation, we get to know the right model the base, the right model, and the nature of our population. Yes.